Before we talk about our products, our business, and some of our customers, if you are going to trust us with your hard-earned money, we think you deserve to know who we are first. The owners of Handy Imports are family members who started from the most humble of beginnings. A lot is personal, so we will skip past the cultural background and the extreme difficulties faced in setting up in our newly found home in Australia. The year was 2000 and the odds were stacked against us. The parents went off trying to get their foreign qualifications to bear any fruit, while the two sons went off getting their own education in place. However, the parents realized it would be almost impossible to get a job with their qualifications and careers. Eager to contribute to society and help rebuild a future for the family, they started completing short courses and wore low-skill work like a badge of honor. The sons were also working hard, finishing up school, getting into university while working nights. Once savings amounted to a small capital, basic business ideas were explored. Few failed and they did hurt, but they were not big enough in the first place to cripple. Some succeeded, like the detergent manufacturing company the engineer parents established from the granny flat. It was a lot of hard work, but was paying the bills, at least most of the time. The success was a massive boost in terms of confidence and some money, but was not big enough to make the transition. It just helped, like all the other efforts, in setting the stage for it. Then one day, one of the sons purchased a Dell laptop from Gray's Online in the hope to sell it at a higher price on eBay. It was a loss in dollar terms, but the potential for a profitable experience with few tweaks was noticed. One of those tweaks was to cut out the postage charge from Gray's Online's side by attending their then traditional auction in Smithfield. The two sons went out doing everything super right. They studied the product catalogs the nights before the auctions, researched the products, and set a strict target to only pay for a great item what could be resold and delivered to the customer at least 30% below market price. Back onto that low stakes detergent manufacturing adventure the parents were leading, it required an electric filling machine as manually it was taking too much time and sweat to fill the bottles. So, to save on money, the mother, Ibtisam, searched for a bargain. After much hard work, she landed on an electric filling machine that was reasonably priced and good in every way except being physically overseas. To help bring it in for a low price, Ibtisam studied the process of importing and took out a license for the purposes of clearing the shipment to save on fees. The success of importing the machine, coupled with the experience in marketing items previously sourced from unpredictable auctions, helped nurture the environment of a solid import and retail business. Now it is 2007 and the first shipment with the purpose of reselling of a carefully selected product arrives after much anguish and anticipation. The shipment fills up the garage to the rim, but it is worth the hassle. The customers loved it. By the time the fifth shipment arrived, a storage spot from Kennard's Seven Hills had to be hired. We soon found ourselves renting a 200 square meter warehouse in Seven Hills. The neighbors did not mind lending us a pallet jack when we had a shipment arriving, and our newly assigned NAB manager did not mind sitting on pallets for a talk. She saw we were driven by purpose, good ethics, and she saw how happy our customers were, and that is all that seemed to matter to her. By 2010, and by word of mouth alone, our customers became many, and the ones we had dealt with kept on coming back. So with their continued support, we expanded the operation and moved to yet a bigger warehouse in Wetherill Park. This time, this monster warehouse was 800 square meters and nine meters high. Although more than six times the space of the previous, it was full and required the rental of an additional warehouse nearby within one year. In 2012, the product range topped the 1,500 products and we were scrambling for space to grow further and offer much more to our clients. 
So we moved to Smithfield, where we currently are, a 5,000 square meter warehouse that holds more than 9,000 products and covers many categories extensively, including commercial kitchen equipment. When it is busy, the yard will have five times 40 HC containers parked and more than 16 staff members unloading using six forklifts, 12 pallet jacks, and boasting a great attitude, an attitude of determination, positivity, and a sense of belonging. In 2014, a seven acre industrial land was acquired by Handy Imports with the purpose of building a warehouse that is more than 20,000 square meters in built space, 30 meters high, and with a yard that can accommodate more than 50 containers at once. At every step along the way, we have put you, the customer, at the center, and success has just been the result. A sincere thank you for being part of the journey, for sharing your experience with others, for rewarding hard work in bringing you great products and great value with acceptance and appreciation.